Hey guys, Anfinum here. Uh, I want to thank you all for clicking on this video specifically, and I want to thank Soylent for sponsoring the video that you guys just watched and sponsoring this video, just to be clear. Uh, one thing I do want to make clear is that Soylent does not have any control over what I say within this video, uh, and they didn't have really much to say about the advertisement that y'all just came from. So they absolutely don't know that what I'm going to do here is shake this bottle open up Soylent here real quick and actually take a big old swig because what I want to do with this video is to really just convince y'all that I'm for real about Soylent. Uh, I approached Soylent for the sponsorship that y'all just watched and I did that because I believe in Soylent as a product. I believe in the sort of mission of Soylent uh, as being like one of the absolute, if not the absolute best meal replacement option that you know, can get you a set amount of calories with a set amount of nutrients that y'all can take a look at right here. And when you drink those 400 calories, you know that you've put something good into your system that can, you know, get you through whatever you are going through. I know a lot of you that may be watching this video might be going to school, you might be going to college, or you may lead busy lifestyles that put you in a position to where you can't always get a great source of food, or you can't make food, or you don't feel like spending a ton of money on food that's going to be good for you. And for those of you who are out there, Soylent is like you, you are the reason why I chose to approach Soylent for the sponsorship. Now, after I drink a bit of this, I'm going to tell y'all about my relationship with Soylent. Uh, and just uh, the main point that I want to make with this video is make your own decisions, but just know where my heart lies when it comes to Soylent. I do personally endorse this product enough to where I'm just, you know, again, you heard, you heard it before here, uh, you know. This thing's nearly full. Let me go ahead and let me drink all of it in this ad, in this, in this unlisted. Y'all came to this unlisted video, so I'm going to do this. Ah, you see that? Wait, okay. There's no, there's no real mustache going on there, but it's empty. It's awesome. Like I have nothing but good things to say about Soylent these days, but let me go ahead and let me uh, take you through a little bit of my story with Soylent. It's not really an in-depth story, but I feel like being for real with all of you right now. So I started drinking Soylent in 2015, 2016 or so when some creator friends of mine, um, I can't remember the exact circumstances, but it was brought up to me and it was a product that I checked out. And from the very beginning, I loved Soylent. Uh, now, I only loved their original flavor, um, and uh, like in the very beginning, but ever since then, I feel that they've really na nailed their uh, their flavor compound, their formula. So, yeah, at one point, I even had my fridge like entirely full of Soylent. Now, that was when I was drinking Soylent for nearly every single meal for a little while, which is not something that I recommend you do. Soylent is meant to be a meal replacement for all of the reasons that I mentioned before. And it's not really meant to be like the thing that you eat all the time, but it is something that I did used to eat daily for at least a good week or two. And I mean, you know, no complaints from me, but it's not something that I personally recommend. But anyways, so I started drinking Soylent in 2015, 2016 or so, and I've been drinking it ever since. I mean, I don't really, I guess, know what to say other than... Well, the one thing I can say is that uh, from that time period until about 2018, I really enjoyed Soylent, uh, its flavor profile. In 2019, they made a, uh, a change to uh, what kind of sugar compound they use. Uh, I don't exactly know the right technical way to phrase it, but they switched their sugar compound to allulose. And the first time around, they really did not nail their their uh, their formula for that at all. It tasted almost like mapley. It you know was kind of a uh, it was, it was difficult. It was very strong. But about a year ago or so, which is part of what prompted me to actually approach Soylent for a sponsorship, they did a revision and they nailed it. Every single flavor of Soylent, at least in my opinion, is pretty good now. Uh, mint chocolate being one of my favorites. The chocolate that you guys just saw is another one of my favorites. Vanilla is really good. The original is pretty good. Strawberry is uh, very good if you're a fan of strawberry. And strawberry was one that they really, at least in my opinion, Opinion messed up with their original 
uh, flavor compound that they used to have. It used to not taste anywhere near as good as it does now. And now it's like, wow, the flavor that I used to completely despise is now fantastic. Like what Soylent, what did y'all do? Can we like advertise here? That's, <laughs> you can kind of hear it spelling out here. So yeah, I'm not too sure what else I really need to say about Soylent other than that. There was no way I was going to do this video in one take after drinking that Soylent. But if Soylent sounds like a product that, you know, would fit your lifestyle, if replacing 400 calories on a whim or, you know, 180 calories if you go with their complete energy option, which is my favorite option if I'm looking to have only a snack's worth amount of calories, then seriously, check it out. Link in the description. Uh, yeah. I hope you all, you know, found this information useful, and uh, that's about what all I have to say for now. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comment section down below, and I will do my best to reply to you guys uh, as much as I can, uh, you know, during the first little while that this video is out. I hope you all have gotten something out of it. My name is Ant Venom, and I bid you all farewell. Thanks so much for watching.